Hello everyone, my name is Pat and I'll be extending over Cartiff's video uh, to solve the various problems in uh, while installing OpenStack. So Karthik left off uh, with this error message. Uh, this essentially happens when either during installation uh, something went wrong and the installation was not complete or while you were uh, trying to remove OpenStack there was some issue. In this case what you can do is try and uh, use these two commands unstack.sh and clean.sh first try unstack.sh and see whether or not the uh, the uh, OpenStack runs and then if that does not work for you then you can try to use clean.sh uh, while in, in the installation folder of OpenStack and you can see whether or not if that if this uh, uh, cleans the issue or if this does not work then you will have to manually uninstall all the packages that have been installed and uh, you can specifically remove those packages which give an error for example over here mysql server is given an error so you can uh, specifically remove those packages as well the next uh, so after all those packages have been removed and or maybe you have used unstack.sh or clean.sh and if that works so there are a few problems that you could face during the fresh installation one of them spe would occur especially while you are when you are installing mysql server for the first time in that case you would have an error where uh, your access would be denied for root at localhost for user root at localhost in that case what you can do is you can follow these four commands basically use mysql update user set plugin mysql native password and so on and so forth uh, in my case i have already used them so uh, i cannot i i, I won't be uh, it won't be very much helpful uh, running these commands again also try to do all this uh, uh, do run all these commands under sudo after that uh, this is one of the issues that you could face uh, also it's possible that when you are running when you are uh, performing the installation and you are running stack.sh this is, this is a particularly long process and it could take even hours it's written here, over here it, it could take about 50 to 20 minutes but it could even take hours in that case if the installation fails always first try to uh, first use unstack.sh if that solves the problem then well and good and then try to use clean.sh if that does not solve the problem and start the installation fresh uh, even if they do not fix the issue, the, the command line itself would show which exact prob, uh, which exact component is causing an issue. Mostly, it would be broken symbolic links or um, unavailable files or folders. In those cases, either delete those files and folders, remove those symbolic links, or change the permission for that folder uh, so that you could read and write into that folder. Uh, these were some of the major issues that we faced while installing OpenStack and uh, yeah, thank you everyone.